James Kaufman, World News Report Today. Today is June 8, 2023, 3.30 p.m. Central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. We have our Tomsk Time Russian model of the Schumann residence spiking off the charts. The actual Schumann residence model in Russia only goes to 40 hertz. We're going to look at some amplitudes to see exactly how high or if we can tell how high these spikes are actually occurring. We did see the same or similar activity yesterday on the Tomsk model. And earlier this morning, UTC time, we had a bunch of spikes on the actual Italian model, which right now shows no spiking, no activity whatsoever. Remember, this is Tomsk time, so it's hard to say exactly when this was, but this has been over the last about three hour period. Now we have spikes up to and over about 50 hertz here, as you can see. There's the white numbers here. Although yesterday we had spike that went up to about 120 hertz. So again, this has been a two or three hour event. And we're spiking pretty hard, upwards of 50 hertz. I want to let y'all see the amplitudes here. This is our Schumann Residence model on our actual Italian or Cumiana model. And we can see that there's very little activity, if none at all. With that said, we're definitely three or four hours behind the other model as the world turns here. And we're going to see if we, well, run into heavy Schumann spiking in the next 30 minutes to an hour and a half, which would probably be from the same source that we see the spiking on the Tomsk model in Russia. God bless you and yours. Let me know how this affects you. If you were able to even sense these spikes that were picked up in Russia on the Tomsk model, were you affected physically or was it more of a psychological effect or a combination of both love to know please share subscribe always remember that anything's possible in bizarro world